the global elite are gathering at the World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland. It's the annual meeting's first winter event in three years, and the ski town attracts CEOs, billionaires, and celebrities for a week of discussions on income inequality, climate change, and so much more. Now, this year's theme, cooperation in a fragmented world. But the event does often draw criticism for attracting the ultra-rich who pontificate about global issues without really committing to fixing them. Your inaction is fueling the flames by the hour. Show me the money. Talk is cheap. It turns out that nobody is as generous with their actual dollars as they are uh, with their pledges in their press release. We can talk for a very long time about all these stupid philanthropy schemes. We can invite Bono once more, but come on, it's we got to be talking about taxes. Yes. That's it. Taxes, taxes, taxes. All the rest is in, in my opinion. One area where we might see some movement is on the breakdown of panels. During the last World Economic Forum, a third of the panels were devoted specifically to ESG. And the use of words like environmentalism in those Davos press releases has actually tripled since 2014. Sometimes who's not there is more interesting than who is. Former President Donald Trump is not attending, nor is current President Joe Biden. An embattled crypto entrepreneur SBF is obviously out, but there will be plenty of panels on the future of digital currency. So follow Quick Take on all social platforms to get our updates on the World Economic Forum on the ground in Davos.